Right, meanwhile, over in Bell County, some voters are still trickling in as well at this hour. That's right. Fox 44's Noelle Mendoza right now still live in Harker Heights. Now, Noelle, you've been there most of the day. How many voters there run into any issues today? You know what, Leslie Robert? People are just happy that voters are doing their civic duty and making their voices heard. A lot of people that I spoke to earlier today say they're so happy with the new electronic voting machines. They say it's making the process so much more easier than before. Those electronic voting machines are not connected to the internet. They simply serve as a ballot marker. Many people saying they're very user friendly and are comparing it to a touchscreen phone. They say if you can dial a number on there, you'll have no problem filling out your ballot on out on the new machines. For some, it was their very first time using it, and they loved it. Yeah, surprisingly, yeah, I think it could work anywhere. You know, I don't know the inner workings of it, but you know what they told me to do and stuff. It was very, very simple. It, it was an easy process. I think everything took about five minutes. You know, so I was in and out. Now, people did, or poll workers did expect the number of people to increase as more people got off from work. But as you can see behind me, there's still no line out the door, which means that things are running pretty smoothly. Polls will close at 7 o'clock, but if you are in line at 7 o'clock, you still will be able to vote. Live in Bell County, Noelle Mendoza, Fox 44 News.